Hey guys, welcome back, Marshall Gaming, and I'm AZJL. Uh, Marsh, I found you a sword, finally. Wow. Uh, we're back in Invalia episode 3, I think it is. Yeah. Kamoshi rage quit last episode because he, like, Marsh... Yeah. Marsh was a derp, and he threw me on top of Kamoshi, so I died by falling, and then I turned into a zombie, and my zombie killed Kamoshi. <laughs> it wasn't <laughs> like, I, I didn't mean to. <laughs> he was killing I, I a zombie, and I walked in front of him. But yeah. Kamoshi, I mean, Marsh, yeah, Marsh, meet me in the mayor's mansion, right, I've got yeah. a wood sword. Nice for me. And, uh, yep. Do you have any wheat? Um, no, but I have, uh... I have so much stuff here. Here, take these instant health potions. Oh, you want an apple? Uh, heck, why not? Um, here, take take these. Wait, I, I need to readjust my bar. Trash. I I have arrows. I have fifteen plus eight. Trash. 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 I also have some antibiotics and some healing ointment. Nice. How many healing ointments? Uh, one healing ointment, two antibiotics. Can you give me one healing ointment, one antibiotic? I'll give you the healing ointment back. I'm going to show you how these work. Oh. Take that, viewers. No, I'm just kidding. Alright, so we're playing Mind Z. I forgot to in introduce that. <laughs> Derp. Oh, we're Kamoshi episode three, three of Mind Z. Oh, Kamoshi, really? Kamoshi plays. Kamoshi plays. Uh, instant health two. Eight. Alright. Yeah. Um, so I have a lot of instant health. Well, let me just drink. And then, are we ready Five. to roll? Oh. You're ready to roll. I'm not. But I'm Watch smart. out, down there there's a lot of zombies. There's like four. Yeah, I killed them all. Except for these three. Or five. Or one. Die! Die, evil beat! I killed it. <laughs> he never even got to move. Dude, so... Place yeah, Marsh is very new to this, but I played Mind Z for yeah. two years now. I think two years. Oh yeah, that chest I left there for you because I didn't know. Watch this. This is what I like snowballs for. I'm nicknaming Marsh, Frosty the Snowman. <laughs> you see me? I got both zombies off the edge. I hit both. Right. I'm naming Frosty the Snowman because in all the other episodes, he's been throwing snowball after snowball after snowball. Dude, so Marsh. Awesome. Wow, I missed. Now they're going to come I towards did not. you. Well, no. I threw it down if over there. If you throw it and you hit a zombie, will they all attack that zombie? No, they get attracted to you. <laughs> Because if you throw something and it hits someone, like, say, grenades, snowballs, and arrows. If you shoot an arrow, throw a grenade, throw, um, yes, there are grenades in this game. They are boss. They're ender pearls. When you right-click them, they're same range as ender pearls, but uh, they so blow. Oh, what are we doing now? Yes. Uh, I'm just trying to get food. Okay, yeah, then because I have a good amount of food. Shoot. I have, like, a couple of apples. I have two apples. A lot of Oh, what I'm food. saying. Arrows, grenades, and snowballs, they make your hunger bar. Alright, you see the um, XP bar? Yeah. The zombie sight rate? It goes all the way full as if you're running and jumping for a split second. For like half a second. Oh, so they... So right, they... here. I found another healing ointment, so now we both have one. We nice. both have a full healing kit. Awesome. So don't drink health potions. Only no. have those when like you're alone or something, when you're doing a video by yourself. How many um, water bottles do you have? I have, I think, I don't know, I think I threw one out. I think I might have, uh, forgot to take them back. should hold on to three, at the most. Oh, why? Because some places don't have water in them. Not all cities you go to have okay. water. Uh, you, can I have one of those? Like, if you have a lot of instant health, can I drink them so that I can have another water bottle? Oh, okay. uh, no, they, they're not supposed to turn into, oh, you have to be damaged first before drinking oh. them. I didn't, there. okay. Uh, they're not supposed to turn into oh. bottles. It's supposed to despawn oh. like that. So I already dropped a water bottle on you, actually. Yeah, you did. So you, you should. Can I keep many... rotten flesh? No. I'll keep a I, I'll keep a few just in case because it seems like I have um 
we're gonna go to Pylos. That thing, that place has a lot of people in it, so we oh, might oh. want to watch. I think bandits. there's a zombie. Oh no! That or is a, it was a person? No, that was. I have my mic slash headset plugged into my tablet, so I can talk to you through. All right, so you want to go? Okay, source. so you want to go to um that place that you were saying? Pylos. Uh, can you go and show the viewers where that is? It's straight north of here. It's a big, gigantic mushroom. Okay. Um, let's see. Where are we? We're right here. Uh, oh. Oh, wow. Yeah. There's a city under the hood. Uh, there's, there's a sort of like a military chests and a civ civilian yep. chest. Yeah, civilian chests are what we're getting here. They have, nice. like, leather armor, wood swords, and food. Military. Uh, oh, there's a lot of military chests, in, 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 like, sort of near this area, I guess. Yeah, there's military chests, and then there's also a... Ooh, cookies time. I'm gonna go craft cookies. There's also a tool chest. Now, okay. the tool chest might give buttons. Buttons are used to unlock doors to dungeons. I want to try and do the Red Demon Temple later on. That'll be a special episode. Because it's to a legendary weapon. Mine Z has, I think, 28 legendary weapons. I mean, I've never... I think it's about 28, 24, something like that. The legendary weapon, Sacrificial Sword, is one of the easiest ones to get. And yet, it still takes like an hour. It takes forever. But we're probably going to do that sometime. Because we're nearby. It's the Red Demon Temple. Can you show the viewers where that is on the map? It's right near Pylos and Invalia. It's like north of Lafayette. It's in that desert biome. Red Demon Temple. Okay. Yeah. What it's it is is you button. Yeah, you go down there and there's a you have there's a gold block. You put a button on the gold block. You press it, and the wall in the cave will open up. They should. They should make a up. bigger. Um. They should make a what's it called? They should make a better like a different map, or bigger map. Uh, dude, this map took forever to make. Although they use World Painter, they didn't actually physically build this, they use World Painter. What do you mean? World Painter is like, it's a program, I'm not too sure what it is, but it's like a program where they choose where the blocks go and it automatically like makes the world for them and then they just upload it into a server and this map appears. Wow, this is your chest. I just opened a chest that had four snowballs. Dude, can I have them? <clears throat> yep, yeah, they're are right you? at the bottom. I'm at the bottom. Oh, can I just jump in the water? Sure, start at the bottom now we're here. Oh, yeah. uh, you gotta be careful from jumping there, because all the trees in the ocean, I mean, in the water. Oh, it's alright, because I know. Alright. It's very, very risky. Wait, oh, you made it? Yeah. Oh, come to me, my derpy slave. No, I'm just kidding. Where are you? I'm near here. Follow oh, the road. Dude, I know where that is. Hi. Hi. I see you. Uh, I see you. Look up. Watch Hi. out, there's a zombie right there. Ah. Yeah, it can't hurt me because it's on the opposite side of the house. Right under me, I dropped the four snowballs. Right, right. under the edge. Oh, nice. Ooh, um, so are, are we going to lose right now? Yep. We... Did I hit you? No. Run, Forrest, run. All right. Uh, do you have a bowl or a mushroom stew? Yeah. You have a mushroom stew? Yeah. How much hunger do you have? Full. Nice. All right, can I have that mushroom stew? I'm not going to eat it just yet, but I have one of each mushroom, so I can make another one soon. So I'll pay you back, basically, in other words. Okay, so we're headed to Pylos. I know the way f by heart because I've played this for so many years. I know almost the entire map. Only thing I don't know is the underground cave system because uh, my computer's 13 years old, so I can't see in there. Why? So if we, well, it's so I have my brightness on bright, my gamma all the way up, and even still, right now, like I can't see the river from here because it all fades out to black. In Tristidia Forest, the dark forest over there, you know what? Sort of a shortcut to go through the forest. I'll show you. Um, it's a dark forest, but Mar Marsh will probably be able to see. It'll just be a black screen for me. It's like, even in the Red Demon Temple cave, like, a lot of people go mining without torches. I can't do that. 
if I go into a cave, it's just a black screen. I can't see anything. I can't even see. Like, if I were holding a bright white bandage in my hand, I wouldn't even be able to see the bandage in my hand. It's just a black screen. So we're going to go here. We're going to take... I'm going to show you guys an example. Is there such thing as boats? Uh, no. <laughs> no. Well, yeah, there's the ghost fleet, if you want to try that. What's that? Um, a dangerous place. It doesn't have chests. Never mind, then. I mean... I'm I'm in for the chests. Yeah, I don't know why it's in this map, just for show, I guess. But it's like you know the entire size of the Invalia Mountain that we just explored from tip to right there. That's how big the main ship is. Oh. That's big. how big it is. That's like massive, and there's it's like six six ships. That's the biggest one. It gets smaller and smaller. It's right near the Sacrificial Pit in Hell Tree, Castle Bysford, Fort Soward, uh, Castle Wavery. Is there, be, is there probably going to be people there? Yeah, it's very far away, but it's in the volcanic region. Okay. Um, if, if, if there's other people, they're going to try to kill us, right? Yeah. Oh, so, my friend Chicken Bob's online. XX Chicken Bob. One sec, I'm just messaging him. Just keep going north. I'll catch up. Oh, God. I'm at, I'm at the Forest of Doom. And so am I, because I'm moving and I'm like 10 blocks behind you. This is the dark evil forest. It leads to Tristidia. Should we cut through uh, it? Um, no, because I can't see, but I'm just going to show you. Stay with me, all right? Stay right next to me. I'm going to show you when it gets so dark I can't even see. All right, it's starting to get dark right here. And it's really dark right where I'm standing. I can't even see the blocks I'm standing on. I can only see patches of light like over there, right there, right in front of us. But right ahead, right where I'm facing, where I'm swinging, it's completely black right here. Wow. It's completely, completely black on my screen. Yeah, so this I'm just is like, go this way. is like crazy. Are, yeah, we, are that's we cutting how, through this place? No, I can't go through it because it gets thicker and thicker and thicker and thicker. To a point that, like, this tree, um, this tree right here, yeah. there's another tree right here. Wow. It's like that close together. And in the middle of it, there's a pigman spawner. I haven't explained to you what pigmen are. There are pigmen spawners in a city, and pigmen, what they are, are regular pigmen in this game, but they've got sticks. And what the sticks do, they're like wands. They can hit you from like five blocks away. They do with your full iron armor, which is the best iron, which is the best armor in this game. If you're full iron, they do three hearts of damage to you every hit. So that means three or four hits on you, you're dead. They can hit you from far away too, like five blocks away. Their hit, your hitbox is like twice as big to them. So they can hit you from pretty far away, do a massive amount of damage, but Here's the problem. When you hit them, they automatically explode and die. They make an explosion. It hurts you, and then what happens? They turn into four midget ankle biters that run super fast. You saw how fast these zombies run already, yeah. right, Marsh? Yeah. T times that by four. Oh, you mean it's like the babies. Yeah, no, I, yeah the babies yeah. run faster than the adults. Yeah, and the adults run that fast in this game. Now, the babies are like twice or three times as fast as the adults in this game. That's how fast they are. And a place like the Savannah, you're constantly hitting the grass like this, so you can't even hit the ankle biters. You're like this. So they're just a huge pain. Uh, Red Demon Temple is straight north, but we can't enter because we don't actually have a button on us. Unless if Marsh has been hiding one on me. Do you have one? No. All right. Um, but we're going to follow the shore of the desert, and this Savannah is going to just loop around back down over there. But if we follow this desert, it goes straight Okay, east after we get back on the other street. side, I think I'm gonna... Oh, wait, 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 let me just drink water. Alright, you think you're gonna start a new episode? Nah. Mm -hmm. Um, but... This thing goes straight east and straight west. It ends soon at the west. But it'll go east until the edge of the map. Okay, let me, let me, edge... bring, let me bring my map up and put it back. Because I, right. I have two screens, so... Okay, well, we'll have pilots right, nice. to fight. You'll... See right here, we see the um, savanna. Soon we'll see a mushroom biome. That's Pylos. Um, but th we're actually on the side of the map. If you can tell on the map, we're actually near the edge. Yeah, we're, we're pretty near the edge. 
Yeah, the map shows that the map ends at X4200, like yeah. really, you can't walk past X3950. What happens is it teleports you back five blocks, and in red in the chat box it says you have reached the edge of this world. They'll teleport you. So if you're like in PvP, now Eternalist Cathedral, you don't have to look at that, but it's a health potion place. It's on the opposite side of Invalid. Oh, Epic Ninja is your friend? No. Oh, I, th I thought someone was your friend. No. Um, I saw him typing, but no. What my friend is is uh XX Chicken Bob XX. Oh, is he is he on Eye of Ender number four? Um, no, but let's actually put our Eye of Enders in nine. See, put your Eye of Ender in the last slot of your hotbar. Now everyone with Eye of Ender nine can talk. And here's the mushroom biome. Most people don't use Eye of Ender nine, so this is like me and your private chat. This is like our messaging system. But there's the um, mushroom right there. Marsh's render distance is probably bigger than mine, so you can see that right there. It's pretty massive. No, I can I can barely see it. I, just, I, I don't even see like the color. I just see like the outline. Yeah, I I have five render. I have five yeah. chunks. I I think I have four. <laughs> All right, I'm getting the color. I have five now. too. Huh. All right, I'm just gonna message Chicken Bob XX Chicken Bob XX. Join I nine. All right, so now you might see him in the Eye of Ender nine. All um, right. I'm detecting four entities, uh, five, three, uh, seven entities. So there are six entities up there. That that means oh, there's I, probably. All right, listen. Entities <laughs> count as like zombies and items on the ground and people. So I, I'm detecting like five zombies up there, and zombies don't spawn in every city just like that. So if they did, then the map would lag so bad. The server would lag so bad. But zombies only spawn in cities if there's a person near it. We haven't been here for that long, so that means there's probably a kid up here. There oh, isn't. where are you? Oh, wait, 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 wait for me to here. get a little bit farther up. I'm right here. <laughs> oh, I but know. none of the gonna... chests really spawned. I'll show you, Marsh, where all the chests spawn. One here. So One in this house. Oh, here's this house. No, they just oh, haven't spawned yet. Two oh, wheat and one of each mushroom. I can make two mushroom stews and another stack of cookies because of that chest. Oh, cool. Can I have a can I have a How many stacks do you have? Oh, wait, wait. wait, wait uh, chest. None yet. Oh, bow, dude, nice. Yeah, that's the military chest. If you have a hoe, you can get some mushrooms up here. And a chest spawns right on here. And let's see, a tool chest spawns over there where the cobwebs are. Someone placed those cobwebs and a chest spawns here. Uh, in tool chests, such as this chest, you can find things such as cobwebs and shovels. Shovels are used to break cactuses and cobwebs. Like, watch Marsh, take out your sword, try and break this cobweb. In the chat, it'll, say, it'll tell you something. You need an iron shovel. Yeah. Iron shovels are the only thing you can use to break cobwebs. Okay, well, I went, I went over it. So someone is in here? Yeah. Or someone was, and they just, like, left or logged out. But don't go down there. That's a suicide. That house is the destroyed, like, decayed house. And once you fall down there, it's very hard to come back up. So you might as well just jump off the edge and suicide. Because, by the way, this is another hanging city. I really like hanging cities. We should go to Ilam later on. But, uh, these hanging cities, if you fall, you're most likely gonna die. Two zombies in here. What I like about hanging cities is that to make the game fair, this map makes it so that barely any zombies spawn in these cities. Other cities that aren't hanging, so that it's not as much of a threat from, like, the ground, I mean, from the, like, land area, the land form, it's not that much of a threat. You can't die from the form with the land. So what they do is they make a zombie spawn rate even higher. So if this place, if there was ground beneath all these houses, if it was just flat land and we're in this big, like, mushroom hut, and we couldn't fall and fall, like, die or whatever, the zombie spawn rate would be probably five times worse than it is now. So instead of those three zombies that we just fought, it would be 18 zombies. Oh, cool. The, uh, what's inside here? Nothing. Nah, nothing yet. I'm not, I think there used to be a chest, but they got rid of it. You wanna go, now, uh, you wanna go somewhere else? No, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you a little trick. 
You come down here, this lets the chest respawn, but the only water source is this. There's no water source in there. You have to drink out of the ocean, which doesn't make sense because salt water, duh. Um, am I lagging? I can't, my thirst bar won't go up. I just drank three, four times, five times. There, I had to drink five times. It stayed at 12 thirst for five times. Cool. Okay, I, wait. Well, I got wait. a bow, so. Wait, wait down here. Um, when a tip happens in chat, dude, wait, wait, stay down here. When a tip happens, then all the mean? chests spawn. Tip, yeah. they'll say this in chat. Like, look at chat box. It says, Have tr having trouble living? More, Move more carefully and more, and, and most importantly, try to make friends who will watch your back. Oh, when a tip happens, okay. What what did you think I was saying? I didn't know what you meant by tip. I thought I don't know. Well, whenever a tip happens in spawn, I mean in chat, zombies spawn and chest spawn around you. In if there's a spawn area for them. Uh, I don't think there's a chest in there. I don't yes. think there. Oh, uh, there was a chest there, but the zombies took over. Um, yeah, the chest respawn. Oh, fudge! Oh, fudge! Oh, crap! Oh, crap! Oh, crap! Fall. Okay, he just walked himself off. No, I hit him off like a boss. Another wheat and another melon. Perfect. Oh, uh, oh, nice! A stone, a stone sword and a stone axe. Okay, here's what you do. Don't throw away the wood sword. You want to save the stone sword for people. So you use your wood sword on zombies and your stone sword or stone axe on people. Use the whatever sword you have that does the most damage on people if you have to. It's like a last resort kind of thing. Four wheat. Are you freaking kidding me? I have That's some cocoa beans. Enough. This thing gives so many wheat and so many cocoa beans, and yet there are no crafting tables, so you can't make cookies. But it gives you the ingredients. But save whatever does the most damage for people and whatever does the least damage until they break on zombies. I think you're going to Palister later on. Now, the reason why we camp camping, we keep camping this these cities like this, because they have food. Really, that's it. This series is going to be long and draggy. Like these yards. <sighs> Alright, um... It didn't spawn any buttons, so... We're not going to Red Demon Temple today. And it's 7.41, wow. It's late tonight. Not really. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going down south, you coming? Yeah. Of course. Um. <laughs> of course. Alright, uh, let's go to Fort Fourth Wind. I kind of want to go where someone is. Dude, what, wait, what's the anti-zombie for fortress? <laughs> that place is a fail. Uh, they named it the Anti-Zombie Fortress because it looks like a place in Japan. It's, there's, um, there's like a factory in Japan, and it looks like that in real life. So they called it in real life the Anti-Zombie Fortress. So they always joked around if there was like a zombie apocalypse, they would hide in that city. Because it's like there's no way anyone could get in or out. But that fortress in this game is the complete opposite. It's all ruined. And so many things can get in and out. It's got one of the highest zombie spawn rates in the entire map. And it's a parkour. So while you're trying to I think parkour, I've been there. Yeah, I've been there. And I was like... Yeah, you're getting like 30 zombies spawning on you. It's vines everywhere getting in your way. Stuff like is that. Is there anything even in there? Yeah, once you reach the top, there's a few chests. But it's, in my opinion, it is not worth it. It's right near Yopton. Just like a bandit oh, camp. What is this? This is Fort Fourthwind. There's one food chest... Uh, two military chests, and another, two more military chests. Um, since I, whoa. <laughs> um, one sec. Since I can't see, can you go up in that tower, because it's really dark? Ooh, chain boots. Dude, Aww. check this out. Check this out. Wait, if you go in the tower, there's probably better loot. But go up in that tower. The entrance is right in that corner. Um... At the top, there's you got a sort of parkour, not really. But I'm gonna do a harder parkour to get a better chest. I'm gonna try. I don't even know if the chest spawned yet. Uh, it doesn't look like it. I don't have a zoom feature. 
Um, I feel like a burp. So, if you guys are enjoying this series, I got ten arrows. If you guys are enjoying the series, please leave a like and comment. Wait, wait, wait. How do I? How do I get to that place? Oh, that's another huh? tower. Where? Huh? Oh no, there's a different tower, and it seems like there's something in it. Ah, uh, I guess. I don't know how to get. I don't know. I don't know how to get up there. Um, come back down. I'll show you. Oh hi, come out the door. Oh wait, 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 wait. Oh, the chest respawned. Really? I think so. At the top of the tower. Okay. Yeah, I'll go back up there. <laughs> um, but yeah, really what I want this series to be like is let the viewers no. choose where we go right, next, so I'm gonna but, um, to get her ready. uh, that's what I was saying. Huh. One sec, I'll be right back. Oh no. Oh god. So yeah guys. Um Okay. So yeah, tell me you guys if you guys if you guys are liking the series. I mean, it seems like I don't know, I like it. If you guys like it, then I I'll I'll be sure to make some more. I haven't really made any videos lately, so I decided to really get back into it and start you know making some videos and yeah minecraft is really really fun if you don't have it i can recommend getting it i mean it's one of my favorite games and yeah so i'll, I'll be following azjl i don't know where he's going he's probably gonna it's probably some parkour oh hardcore parkour nice you probably eat a cookie Oh, you can hear me? Nice. Alright, so. Oh, oh, I fell. You okay? Alright, I'm back. Um, I, I think I just saw a kid. Uh, I'm coming down to heal you. Hi. I just saw a kid, so we're ah. leaving. Snowball! No, don't. Wow. Oh, fudge. I almost hit you. Come on, there's a kid over there. I saw a name tag. We don't want to be in a fight in the way we are. Now, come here. Oh, okay, I, I don't something. have much food. Okay, but I got something very special for you. Nice. I also got a bow for myself. Cool. Um, I sh I'm just going to eat the rest of my cookies. Okay. Uh, I got a mushroom stew. Do you need it? No. Yeah, yeah, I do. Alright, um, because I can make another one, so just give the bowl right back. Do you want to head back to Invalia? Because I can make two stacks of cookies. Nah, better not. Because, I don't know, is there a crafting table anywhere nearby? Uh, there's If you saw one... a kid, we can go and try to kill him. Not really in the condition we are. Because we're still, we sell leather armor. When the area that we actually are, we skipped all the spawn towns. Where you really start off. We went straight to these places. Uh... You know how zombies spawn like this in the wild? Past Y-2000, that's the far north region, that's like volcanic area. And it past there, that's where zombie pigmen spawn naturally, and giants. So like, it's very dangerous. Fact that we're only 800 blocks away from that, and 1,200 blocks away from spawn, 
we're closer to the dangerous areas than we are to the safe areas. We're leather armor, so we should be in spawn towns. We should be far south. But we, we skipped all the... You think we should go there and then, like, fight people and take their armor? Uh, we can try, but we'll probably die. Get it? Rhyme? Rhyme. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, but um, I, I want to find some more cities to, like, get stuff. Alright, we're near Fort Rockwood. It's a very good place on getting chain and uh, iron armor. Me and my friend were camping it the other day, and we both went there chain armor, and he left full iron armor. So that means he got all four pieces of iron armor. Sort of on top of the hill, and it's a fort, so it's got like a fort wall, like a castle wall around it. But the back is kind of broken. So you can walk in from the back. It consists of three houses. It has oh, a no, birth oh, source. Oh, oh, and here it is. Wait, were you recording? Yeah, I was. I was gonna... Is this Romero? Nope, this is Fort um, Rockwood. Is there people here? Nope, not at the moment. Uh, actually... I hope not, but I think I just might this have saw... This is where you. I went. This is uh -huh. where I went. This is the place where um, I said dude, that Dude, I... dude, 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 what? dude. One, these for me. Oh. Poof. <gasps> oh. Wait, you can have it. No, it's fine. It's, dude, keep it. It's going to break anyway, so keep it. But it's that's the rarest armor in the game. Nice. Strongest and rarest in the game. See what I said? It's got chain well, and iron yeah, armor. Yeah, I'm in yeah. this house. I'm right here. We in this little that. house. I, I used to do that. I'm gonna go. I, I, I don't know. Wow. I'm gonna try to find some other dude. Houses. Oh, nice. Dude. Uh, a ball. Dude. Yeah. Wait. Dude, come look at me. Wait. I just wanna get a ball. Uh, a fixed Wait. ball. Look. Look at me. I can't believe this. Oh my God. Is your <laughs> is your, is yours like a lot of health? Yeah, it's half durability. What? That's awesome. <laughs> 118 durability out of 200. Wait, wait, let me try to get it. Grenade. Grenade. Oh, dude. Power. Dude, can wait. I have the power one ball? I'll trade you. Yeah, you have that. I'll take your bow. Your boy. I got a stone sword and check out grenade. I'm just going to waste this one to show you what it does. No. Don't. Look out the window. Ah, watch out. Oh, fudge. Wait. Oh, God. That was a grenade. I screwed up, I missed the zombie. It one hit KOs zombies and does three to four hearts of damage on people. My sword broke, so now I have to use this stone sword. Yeah, I remember this a place. lot of people were here. Alright, come on out. Um the chests haven't spawned yet. If you're in the city, the chests won't respawn. So what I do is I just come out right here. Watch out, there's some zombies that are Right. You you just stand right here and the chests respawn just like that. Oh, so we can go back in there and be back? Yeah, um, if your cha if your iron chest plate breaks, here. There's a chain chest plate. Nice. Or you might just want- Uh, you just picked up my trash. <laughs> That's fine. Um, you might want to wear the chain chest plate until we enter a town. Like, wear it for zombies, and when we're ready to fight a person, we see a person, just slap that iron armor on and get ready to fight. Okay, a chest- chest respawn because a tip just happened. But a lot of zombies probably spawned too. Um, did this chest respawn? Yes, it did. Two snowballs. Seriously? It's a martial chest. It really is. Cat. Well, I threw a snowball at you. Why? It does no damage, and I wanted zombies to attack you. I have chainmail leggings. Nice. So I can I, just, I can mix these together and. You know, it's stuff. a very good um. Strategy. Sorry, we're just we're just like looting and stuff, so I should probably I should probably end it until something good happens. Yeah. Uh chain helmet. That's really good. Nice. <laughs> I'm like, wow, look at all me. Alright guys, well thanks for watching everyone. And um Wait, look at me, look at me, look nice. at me. Dude, look at me. <laughs> Coolio. Uh, alright, well I'll talk to you later. Please yeah. like, comment, subscribe, do all that fun There's stuff. Check it out my camera. I my Wow, camera. check out my camera. Yeah, no, come check out my YouTube channel. Um, subscribe to Marsh and me. Really helps. We all like it. Yeah. Uh, subscribe to me if you want Pokemon videos. Subscribe to Marsh if you want Minecraft videos. And other and videos.
I think that's the, yeah, and other videos, since he doesn't just do Minecraft. He does a lot of other crap. <laughs> crap. Yeah. <laughs> um, but I think that's it. That's all for all episode right. yeah, see three. Yeah, you later, guys. Three. Yeah, so three.